Here, we're going to start it out with the, you know, this way real quick, and then it's going to be all done, because I'm not going to talk about it anymore on this video. I'm fucking tired of it right now. I cannot believe the person that says that they love me is going to go on a fucking live stream of over 500 people and give out their fucking Snapchat. And then the motherfucker sits there and tells you that he doesn't have Snapchat. And you're like, oh, come to my come to my channel. Make it private, why don't you? It's fucking dude. Lame. Lame, lame, lame. Check it out, motherfucker. Tomorrow. This is for all my subscribers. Tomorrow. I'm making a fucking video, right? I'm gonna make a video. And in the description is gonna be my Snapchat. If you want it, fucking try to add me, you know? Maybe I'll add you. <laughs> Maybe I won't. But you can go ahead and add me. That doesn't mean I'm gonna accept your fucking ass. But hey, go for it. Go for it, motherfucker. You know? We can, we can all have fun, right? We can all fucking just fuck around. Yeah, we're just talking, right? We're not, we're not doing anything. We're just talking, so... Everything should be fine, right? Like, me and these people, we're not doing anything. We're just typing. It's not even that we're even talking. So, it shouldn't be anything bad, right? Yeah. I said, I haven't done nothing like that. But, tomorrow I'm making a fucking video. I'm probably not even gonna do it, because I'm a fucking pussy. Right. My plan is to make a video and put my Snapchat in it. Because I'm tired of all the bullshit. Alright, well, let's fucking move on from that, because it's fucking ridiculous. It's probably not gonna happen. It's probably not gonna happen. <laughs> I'm not gonna fucking put my Snapchat to anybody to see. Nobody needs to see my shit. Nobody needs to fucking talk to me. So fuck all you motherfuckers. <laughs> you probably got your hopes up a little bit there. Maybe one of these days, though, yeah? Just to prove a point. That's all. Sounds like an ambience. Could be a bubble. Huh? Still sounds like an ambience. Anybody make an ambience? Yep. Ambience. <laughs> Taking it slow tonight, motherfucker. <laughs> I already drank three of those earlier today. Cool. I drank one in the afternoon. I drank one in the or two in the late afternoon. And then I drank another two in the late evening. And then right now it's what let's see what time it is. What time is it? 
It's almost nine o'clock. Yeah, it's almost it's eight fifty four. And I'm on another. <laughs> on another two. <laughs> so yeah. All together obviously seven so far. And I got one more at home. And I got one more in my backpack, so in all actuality I got two more Pullmans in this happy. And now if I can have to go get set up again for tomorrow, I don't know. I might try to keep one for tonight. Or keep one tonight for tomorrow, yeah? So I have like that early fucking afternoon. Fucking hate going to buy a four pack of these. First thing I do is have to open one. Because <laughs> I need my one. <laughs> Gotta have one. Gotta have it. Gotta have it. Gotta have it. Gotta have it now. Gotta have it now. To be honest, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I really don't like them when they're cold. They're a lot more potent. Got another one. Got a full one. Cold as a motherfucker. Oh yeah. Put that in your pocket. Put it in your pocket. Put it in your pocket. And me in pocket. Yeah, warm that motherfucker up. Because like I said, these motherfuckers, these, especially the Chardonnay, they taste way better warm. Personally, that's my personal preference. I, I think they taste way better warm. You're asking me why you shake that shit up like that all the time. To be honest, I think it's because I'm trying to warm it up. <laughs> You're feeling right now. <laughs> Buzzing like a motherfucker. Like big time. I'm feeling great actually. Actually I'm feeling like hella. Other than I didn't wear tall socks today. And my fucking ankles keep getting air on. Fucking cold right now, yo. It's like 49 I think. 49-ish with like a, a hmm, like a 15 mile an hour wind or something with like 20 mile per hour wind gust <laughs> it's fucking chilly as a motherfucker right now ain't no fucking joke Timing when I turned around there. <coughs> I gotta clear my throat, god damn it. <laughs> So you cannot be drinking on property. Like, dude, I gotta clear my throat, and they're like, "Oh, is that marijuana smell?" But like, yeah, that's why I'm fucking coughing. <laughs> dude, right? Oh shit. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, hopefully that's here at the gas station, not at the car lot next door. Damn. You know, that'd be fucked. <laughs> that knows anything about drinking should know that also when you drink cold beer or cold anything before it gets to your stomach 
it has to warm up. Because otherwise they just fuck, fuck up your stomach. Right. It's got to warm up before it gets to your stomach. So, it can actually break down and do what it needs to do or what it wants to do to your body, right? So, in all actuality, drinking a warm beer or warm anything, room temperature, liquor, or fucking alcohol is actually smarter. It's like shit, bro. It's just like, that's just plain and simple, yo. Plain and simple. Plus, plus, if you really think about it, more bacterias, more bacterias grow in warmer weather, right? In room temperature weather than in like a, a really, really cold environment, like environment, unless it's damp. But I mean, come on. We're not trying to go fucking moldy cheese or mushrooms. We're trying to fucking have good wine. So keep that shit in a warm room, bro. Not even warm. Shit, out, motherfucker. I need to shut up. I ain't gonna tell you motherfuckers how to drink. Drink like a pro, motherfucker. I gotta wait for this fucking little bottle to warm up a little bit anyways. So hey, I'm gonna fucking upload this video. We're already almost at 12 minutes, so don't wanna be getting it too long. Plus it looks like I got a snap, yeah? Haha. <laughs> that.